Okay, you might have heard a private jet company tried to sue Logan Paul over this. Oh, shit. Hey, get oh, Logan. Shit. Open which way? When? When? Or which? Pull it. This is great. Now I know what happens. We need, really need to open it. So what actually went down? So I opened this door. I thought I did a good deed. I had to write a letter to the FAA, like, saying what happened. And today I get a letter from the charter company saying like it's my fault the lead passenger on the flight was logan paul prior to the commencement of the flight mr paul forcibly opened the door to the aircraft this all happened before the flight even started but logan and everybody around him said they could already feel their ears popping that's a huge clue your ears pop when there's a pressure difference and if that was happening on the ground it suggests the cabin was already pressurizing now when the cabin has higher pressure than the outside air a force will push in this direction. The only thing holding it in is the mechanical latch on the door. That's what keeps it sealed tight to the fuselage. So when Logan helped and jammed the door, as instructed by the cabin crew, you guys gotta open that. he basically removed the force that held the door shut. So the door ejected rapidly and forcefully. Yeah, he said it exploded. The door! But if they used it as steps to get off the plane, then the door was very much still intact. 